Hi, I'm Crypto Lou, and welcome to my channel. Today I'm going to be taking you through a beginner's guide of how to create an Ethereum paper wallet. I've actually already created a couple of other tutorials for creating Bitcoin paper wallets and altcoin paper wallets. However, the process is slightly different for Ethereum paper wallets. So what I thought I'd do is take you through that process today. If you like this video today, then please do give me a like. It really helps me to understand what kind of content you like and enjoy. So if you're currently holding Ethereum, one of the safest ways to do so is by using either a hardware wallet, such as the Ledger Nano S or Trezor, or by using offline paper wallets. Especially if you're dealing with larger volumes of coins, as it's safer as it's being kept away and offline away from any hackers. So to create an Ethereum paper wallet, what you need to do is go on to www.myetherwallet.com. Now I've actually created a full tutorial and review of my Ether wallet. And what I'll do is I'll put it in the top right hand corner now. So if you do want to take a look at that, then please feel free to do so. So to create your paper wallet, first thing you need to do is create a new wallet. So what you will do at this stage is simply enter in a password and then click on to create new wallet. Then what you need to do is download your key store file. You basically just needed to unlock your wallet via My Ether Wallet. And then click on to I understand. You're now provided with your private key. So what you need to do with your private key, again, is ensure that you keep that somewhere safe. Keep it in a safe, keep it somewhere absolutely private and don't share that with anybody else. Then what you can do is you can go through and you can print your paper wallet. So again, you have a nicer design option. So you have your address where you can send your Ethereum to, and then you have your private key in here as well. Now, with regards to your private key, as they say here, do not lose it. It cannot be recovered if you lose it. Do not share it. Your funds will be stolen if you use this file on a malicious slash phishing site and make a backup. Um, secure it like the millions of dollars it may be worth one day. So you need to ensure that you really are saving that private key and you're not sharing that with anybody else. So that was a very brief overview of how you go through and create your very own Ethereum paper wallet. If you have any questions today, then please feel free to put them in the comments below. And like I said, I have already created tutorials of how you go through and create paper wallets for the likes of Bitcoin, altcoins, and Monero. So if you want to take a look, then please feel free to look at through the series of these videos. And I hope that you enjoyed this video today. And if you did, then please give me a like. If you'd like to see more tips, reviews, and tutorials, then please hit subscribe. Thanks, and I'll see you soon.